All right then, so we have our cards being flipped correctly now and then flipping back if we don't get a match. Now, I'd like to add some animation or transition effects to this so it actually looks like a card flipping over. So the first thing I'm going to do is paste in the new CSS and then I'm going to explain it. So we've kept the two classes from the last lesson, but we've also added a couple of properties to them, which I'm going to talk about in a minute. We've also got these two extra classes down here to style the back of the card. So first of all, we style the back of the card without the flipped class and then with the flipped class. So by default, remember, the back of the card is showing. But then when the card is flipped, we're now taking the back of the card and rotating it 90 degrees around the Y axis so that it doesn't show on the page. And then because on the back, we also have the transition property with a duration of 0.2 seconds, that transition, the rotation, is going to animate over that time period. So it's going to look like it's flipping around. Now, likewise, we add the transition property to the front of the card, which also specifies a duration of 0.2 seconds. So when the card has the flipped class, this will animate from 90 degrees to 0 degrees. So it kind of turns in. But this time around, there's a 0.2 second transition delay. And this is so the back of the card can animate out rotation first. That takes 0.2 seconds to complete. So we add that delay to the front card rotating in. So the back rotates out first and then the front rotates in. And then we have the same effect for rotating the cards back again once the flipped class is taken off them. The front transitions out first with its rotation to 90 degrees. Then after 0.2 seconds, the back rotates in again. So this was a little CSS transition tutorial, I guess, more than React. So don't fret if you didn't follow along with this too much. You're here to learn about React, not CSS. I just wanted to add this to give the project a bit of a shimmer. Anyway, let's check this out in a browser. All right then, so now when we click on these cards, the animation looks a little bit better. Now it looks a little bit more like cards flipping over and back again. Awesome. 